Hey there everyone, Trentia here, and welcome back to Jedi Outcast. So, we just got done being in Nar Shada after getting our lightsaber back after some sad, sad uh, Jan death. And now we find ourselves in a secret area of the 8th level, ninth level? I don't remember which one this is. Make sure you... Oh fuck, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm supposed to be grabbing all these and using them as I go. Whatever. So, fuck you. So, now time for some fun stuff. So when you get into this room, you can just throw your lightsaber through the window. Come on, dude, what are you doing? No. You're fucking me. Where's my fucking lightsaber? Hello? Okay, well. Fun fact, we have to res we have to quick load. So my lightsaber just kind of decided to not fucking work. Anyways, throw your lightsaber through. There you go. That breaks the explosive barrel on the back side of that wall. And we skipped uh, a sizable chunk of the stage right there. And now time for a fan favorite or something. Alcatar? Lando, what are you doing here? What does it look like I'm doing? I'm sitting in a cell. What about you? I'm looking for Rilo Baruch. You too? What's the Republic want with him? A ship of his was involved in an incident on Artis Prime. Remnant stuff. The Remnant? Blast. Now it's starting to make sense. What? Over the past few weeks, a mineral smuggling ring has infiltrated the Cloud City on Besman. Real slick group, too. They commandeered half of our loading platforms and carbonite chambers before we knew what hit us. No one knows who's behind it, but it's become obvious that Rilo's garbage haulers are handling the transports. I came down here to find Rilo and persuade him to hand over the names of his employer. Persuade? Hey, I can be a charming guy when I want to. After a few bar fights and card games, I hadn't gotten any closer to Rilo, but I had begun to hear about a remnant bigwig named Dasan. Then I was captured. Dasan? You know him? He's a dark Jedi. He and the Remnant have been performing sick experiments on New Republic citizens, among other things. Like I said, the Remnant connection makes sense. These smugglers are much more organized than the kind of scum we usually get on Bespin. They've got to be Imperials. Want me to get you out of here? If it's not too much trouble. You'll need the password to get into Rilo's command center and open the cells. Any idea what that might be? Yeah, it's Ruby Bleals. I could go for one of those. Yeah, me too. I'll be right back. I'm not going anywhere. Emphasis on right back. <laughs> Alright, so the only, like, so when you're speedrunning, you immediately smash the use button to skip the cutscene, and you, you'll still be, like, right here. So it's quicker. So now time for my favorite part. No, not reading the ingredients. But instead... Skipping more of the level. So I can't do like the god version of it, but I can do this one. Sometimes. Whoops, no, I, I started turning way too late. There we go, we just do that. Touch this. <laughs> it uh it didn't catch the Ruby Bleals. So if you don't talk to Lando before coming here, that floor that I, I, you had to step on in order to talk to the guy, will uh, you'll just kind of let down into an electrified room. Oh, fuck that, yeah. There, there were some guys there. Nice, that's the first time I've got a one, the first try on that for a long ass time. I'm just gonna come over here and grab that. Fill up on this. So this is another instance of, if I was speedrunning, you can, uh, use a vid reset command here and take out all the turrets before they actually mean anything to you. Looking for something? Not anymore. You're Rilo Baruch? In the flesh, but who are you? Does it matter? Not really. Any last words? What's a respectable gangster like you doing mixed up with a remnant slime like Dasan? Making money, of course. Yeah!
Even Kyle knows capitalism bad. <laughs> yeah, I need to like hit these shots. I'll just do this. This is the much easier way to do it. So yeah, this isn't really bad. You can really just like circle, like out circle straight these things. Fuck off, please. I need you all to die. So be careful not to get too close to those doors over by where, where Reload Group was. You're going to want to have a little bit of pre-planning for that. Okay, you... Just want to get shot, you know? Just the motherfucker, you know? Okay, so we'll just go back here and uh, restock up with anything we might need. Except for apparently shield things, there's only one. So yeah, you need to be really quick with this. It's, it's not bad enough there's already like a fucking firing squad there, but they have snipers. Where's Relo? How could a... <laughs> Shut up, Kyle. Just eat your back, the grandpa. Now, there might be a issue where that sound effect just plays. Ah, but we don't get it today. That's nice. I usually get it every time I play this. And just that mission objective thing will just constantly play every couple of seconds. Yeah, so secret area. Uh, this place kind of sucks to go down. EBH. Okay, but now we're out. But be careful before you drop down. A roadie's out to get shot in the junk. Completely disintegrated. Now this is very temperamental of like where it wants to work. If I can just top off, we're in perfect shape going to the next level. Uh, no. Don't go this way. What am I doing? What went on up there? I ran into Relo. Did he tell you anything about the smuggling ring? We didn't talk much. I see. Listen, we'd better get out of here. My ship's hidden nearby. What about yours? Relo's thugs have probably already stripped it for parts by now. What about Jan? Jan's not with me on this one. You two have had another one of your fights, haven't you? Well, come on, let's go. You can buy some flowers on Besman. Once again, I'd like to point out that Billy D. Williams is... He is just fucking phoning this one in. Whether Novaxian wants to admit it or not. Come on, Billy D. We got a ship to get. Nothing. No sound. Oh, that was weird. It sees how I was like up against the wall. It was just constantly bouncing back and in. Nope. Don't let this guy even get one grenade off. He's got to press the button. Another fun party trick you can do on this stage coming up. So we go up. Get that massive speed, and there it be. <laughs> oh, I'm in the way. <laughs> ah, there's my baby. Hope they took good care of her. Give me a minute to check things out. So at this point, like I do, is just go back like three window panes, and then come back. How's it look? Well, it doesn't look like we can just fly her out of here. She's held in place by magnetic moorings, and they've got one tough tractor beam online. I can deal with those here, but that doesn't solve the bigger problem. The entrance to the pad is closed, and I don't think they're going to just open it up for us if we ask politely. You'll have to find the flight control center and open the door to the star pad. Better get going. I would guess we can expect some company pretty soon. Good luck, Kyle. Thanks, Lando. All right, so we just head down here. Do we go in here? Okay, so this room is dark, so let's just get our LAGs on. So what we can do 
just jump up here. And if we're good with it... Oh, fuck. We'll actually jump too far. I was just trying to jump on top of the other thing there. Oh, fuck. I see. I just kind of like went in a weird backwards circle. So there we go. Yeah, so we can just do this and uh, just be done with it all. I don't even think I actually had to come back out here now that I think about it. I think I could just continue walking outside from where I came out originally. We gotta be careful with this fucking clown. Yeah, a whole lot of these motherfuckers throwing grenades, and I hate all of them. Oh, please, no, please, 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 no. Like, what a shitty room. Snipers and thermal detonator guys. Nope. Yeah, it's weird. If I, like, double tap Q, it seems to, like, do force speed or something. Really weird. Yeah, I'm kind of shit for health right now. Huh. I think I need to hit a button over here. I don't know. I might do a little bit of experimenting right now. Oh, uh, no, there's no way. There was too much of a lip. I couldn't jump up there if I wanted to. Okay, well, we're just gonna wait for whatever grenade that dude just fucking threw to go away. Just in time. Okay, back on full health. Fuck you. Yeah, you just gotta be like so quick on the draw with these fucking snipers. Which there'll be more of coming up here. Yeah, right around the corner. Yeah, like, that reaction time is beyond insane. Like, we're talking better than like a fucking pro player at like Counter Strike with an AWP. Oh, this is gonna make me sit around, ain't it? Oh no, we're good. All right, so then we just kind of go around the right side, I believe. Whoa, <laughs> a little too uh, wide with my turning, I guess. We're not wide enough. Who knows? Just around the corner, we will find ourselves in a whole new world. Hey, buddy. Glad you made it. Unfortunately, they didn't bother the refueler. This should take a few minutes, then we're out of here. Alright, so it, as he's saying that, enemies are coming through the back door. You gotta be real fucking careful with this. Because Lando will just kind of sit there and take punishment. Okay, I think they're done from this side. They're gonna come from the other side. Yep, already in. Oh, well, they already broke one of the crates. I need to break later. Thanks for the speed, guys. Now you kill him from the front, you gotta go back to the back. This guy needs to die immediately. Same with this guy. Okay, so he's gonna go inside. Which is great for us. Sorry if that made you vomit. But you can increase your range of attack if you turn your camera. Okay, let's just double back to... Ugh. You two weak weight brothers need to get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Ow. Is there still a guy in here? No, I think we have to go talk to Lando for the next part. Kyle, we've got a problem. So what's new? There's no fuel coming through the lines. They must have the valve closed at the main tanks. See if you can get out there and open the right valve. They use a code system to make sure you get the right one. And you'll still need to find the controls for the roof tank. They have to be around here somewhere. Okay, yeah. I think I was supposed to go out the other door. But this will be fine. Because... Wow, did I actually hit him in the head? Yeah, because we have snipers. But more importantly than a sniper... There's this guy all the way up here. There will be another sniper over there.
now. Okay, so I'm gonna just, you can do a little jump like that in order to get there. There's a secret over here that I think has something that I need. But I th think we need to, uh, no, no, we can just force jump up there. Do a little turn. Okay, no, this is as back to, which, you know what, that works. I haven't got a recoin, a uh, recoin, a recon droid yet, but I know we'll get one along the path we take. I think. Anyway, so I believe you change this one three times or twice. Hey, no. Right, other way around. This is this one. This is this one. Yeah, I just had to go out the back door. That's right. So we also have to go. Over here where I talked about uh, them breaking some crates for me. And then for style, you just spam forward direction and jump. And uh, it's great. We gotta hit all four of these. And after we hit all four of these, grab these shield boosters, hell yeah. Hit this last one over here. And then we just leave. And then we gotta do it on the other side as well. Might as well just grab this. This one we need a force push out of the way. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, sometimes things get a little weird. Fuck off, Grasshopper. Uh, that was lucky. Four. Uh, if only there was more shield boosters than this one. Like, I would just cut off Lando completely. I know this next stage isn't necessarily one of the one of my faster ones. I just know the path. We're out of here. Oh, there's still a bit more to the stage, though, to be fair. That doesn't sound good. I don't believe it. It's not my fault. Uh-oh. Going somewhere, gentlemen. You'd better get on the gun and hold them off. I'll have this fixed in a jiffy. I love the framing with the widescreen. It's just too good. Too powerful. So yeah, now we come over here and activate this gun. Let's get rid of Reload first, because he's on the turret. And now we just gun down everyone. God, like, the shake when you fire is insane. Off we go. All right, say goodbye to this wretched hive of scum and villainy, and hello to Cloud City. Need any help? Just sit back and get some rest. I'll work out a plan to get the sand and his remnant friends out of my city. On second thought, Tavion, kill her. Kyle! Oh! <laughs> Kyle, wake up. Uh, no, no, Chad. Kyle, are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll be fine. Good. While you were sleeping, I hailed a new Republic base on Solace. They haven't shown much interest in our little smuggling problem in the past, but now that they know remnant forces are behind it, they're eager to pitch in. A strike team should be arriving on Besman within a few hours. No! I thought you'd be happy to... They'll tip off the sun. Then we'll catch him later. Getting the sun isn't as important as clearing the city. Chan's dead, Lando. The sun and his minion killed her. Grife, I'm sorry, Kyle. <sighs> okay, okay, here's what we'll do. I'll drop you off on the lower levels. They've probably been overrun by remnant troops, so watch out. Chances are that Desan's operating from one of the loading bays above level 10, but you'll never get in without the proper access codes. Try to find Carbonite Chamber 17. I've hidden an old R5 unit there with codes to every loading bay in the city. You always did plan for the worst. Ever since that run-in with Vader. Anyway, I'll head up top and gather some old friends from the security force. We'll work our way down towards your position. If we're lucky, we can trap Desan before the New Republic arrives. It's always the fucking music, man. 
always the music. But hey, here we are, over here in Cloud City. You gotta be careful here, though, because when this comes down, when this comes down, there's a gust of air that will blow your ass away. The, I forgot what, what's even on the secret that's up here if you jump somewhere. The only thing I remember is that I need to be very careful. Actually, fuck it, I don't need to kill these guys. I'm fucking out of here. See you, losers, virgins. Fuck you. Kill you. Hey, now. You're gonna die, son. Get the fuck away from the grenades. <gasps> There's one out here. Yeah. He fucking had martyrdom. I cannot believe that shit. Fuck off. You and your martyrdom having friend. Pussy. No. Yeah, that's right. Eat fucking shit. There's no way. Is there another one? Or was like... Okay, yeah. He uses the arm of the champ. <laughs> so, you can either kill this guy and do this all yourself, or you mind trick him and he opens the door, and then you wait. No. Okay, then you hit him up. Then you turn that speed on, break this, and get the fuck out of here. I'm also going to take a second to heal. Which, from this angle, makes it look like Kyle's thinking really hard. Now, yes, I do have Bacta, but I like to use the Bacta for combat situations. If I can, I just like to back or, you know, force heal up a little bit. Now, I don't know if there's anything too scary on the other end of where we're going, so I'll get prepared for that. Oh, never mind, I'm a fucking liar. Ah, oh, fucking hell, I fucking hate snipers so much. No, just please, let me fucking kill. I just got him. So this room is kind of dildos. Um, the enemies don't spawn until you're on the elevator. I don't know why I just save right there, but I'll just I'll save when I get on it. So the second this thing hits the bottom, you want to turn on speed and get the fuck over there. Because you're about to go on a ride. Please just die in one shot. Now you cannot touch these pipes that are red on the sides because you will die a horrendously fast death. Okay. Getting to the last level here. Nice. Cool. Then fuck this grenade guy. He can go suck a dick. <laughs> you too. Absolutely you too. Not in here. You can go out there and have fun with that grenade, Mr. Weakway. And, okay, I feel pretty good about how that transpired. Now you get a... Was this the fun room? Almost. Almost to the fun room. So let's go ahead and refill my ammo. I think it's this one. This is the money. Yep, this is it. Cool. I'm the best. So, we then just kind of come here, wait for a gust of air to happen. Somewhere. Over this way will be. Then we just come up. And I like to... Nah, I could have went. You just gonna know that lasts for a bit. But uh, I like to force push my enemies right off the fucking cliff. I almost started going. See you, bitch. 
Now, I know, it's much more efficient just to kill your enemies, but you need to make them sense fear. If they don't know fear, are you really doing your job? The other day I sent a Snapchat out where I mistakenly called this game Jedi Outlast. <laughs> and, uh, you know, for everyone in th that's a part of the Remnant, this shit is... Excuse me? This shit fucking is Outlast for them. Hello? Okay, I was gonna say, like, are you kidding me? I sense a disturbance in the force, but there's something strange about it. You will die. Okay, so we don't necessarily have my preferred ways to fight Reborn yet. So, we'll just try this one for now. This works much better when you have Light Style. Okay, well he's dead. But uh, yeah, Light Style is really good. He looked like a Jedi and fought like a Jedi, but... <laughs> oh, you can just cut out audio by putting your lightsaber into a wall, it's good to know. Now I think about it, I think that is actually part of the speedrun tech. Yeah, so we'll get light style, I think, in like a stage or two. Uh, that is my preferred way to fight. Wow, really? Yeah, eat shit, bitches. Because you can just kind of crouch with four speed and spam left and right, which is just great. Very good stuff. And then there's also, when you get heavy style, there is a decent way to like one shot these guys. Which, are you gonna come down, bud? I'd like to maybe kill you. Yeah, otherwise, my general tactic is I like to try to bait them to jump and then like force pull them just so they fall down. Yeah, unlike Jedi Academy, you don't have the ability to do the, the stab after rolling. Which is just fucking easy mode. <laughs> and so those guys are dead. Save a droid. You must be the droid Lando told me about. And yeah, in this case, we'll just push this guy. The fuck over there, bitch. Lift this elevator up. Oh, <laughs> okay, I just killed him. But unfortunately, it looks like this is going to have to be it for this episode, because we're getting really close to half an hour. And I mean, I'm trying to think of how long... Yeah, this stage does kind of go on for a minute. This is one of the stages I did in uh, the Let's Play. So, next time we'll finish up Bespin and maybe do like the first stage of the next area. This depends. So until then, I'm Trentia, and you guys have a good day.